this video is to help you set up your calculator so that you can find the line of regression uh, curves of best fit. This is specifically for uh, Unit 4 and, um, and Lesson 4. One of the first buttons that you'll want to find is the STAT button. You'll be using this a lot. Under, if you click STAT, you'll see a menu pops up. The ones that we'll be using mostly are Edit and Calc. Click Enter, and you'll see under the Edit button are lists, and this is where you'll be entering data. So if you, to enter data, you just click the number and hit Enter. So here I'm just going to enter a little bit of information. And then I can go over to L2 and enter information also. Enter some data. It's important to notice that I have the same uh, numbers, uh, same amount of data in list 1 as I do list 2. Now a quick way to clear my list is to go up to L1, L, the top of the list, in this case L2, hit clear and enter. Then I can go over to L1, hit clear, enter, and my lists are now clear. Now if I hit stat again, and we'll go back to see what's under the calc menu. Under the calc menu, we'll primarily be using numbers 4, 5, 6, and 7. Line of regression, quadratic regression, cubic regression, and the quartic regression. We don't have data in our list right now, so it wouldn't do us any good to explore those areas. We would just get an error message. But you'll become familiar with those later. Right now it's just important that you know where they are. Okay, by hitting second mode, I'm back to my start screen, and you have another thing you need to have turned on, and that's the diagnostics. So if you hit second zero, which is brings you to your catalog, we need to go to diagnostic on. You can get to the D's quickly by clicking the D button, which is the X to the negative first power. And then scroll down to diagnostic on, hit enter, and hit enter again. And it will say done, and so you know that your diagnostic is on. You also need to have your graph set correctly. So go to second y equals, which is stat plot, hit your enter button, and you'll see that the on is flashing. So I'm going to hit enter so that my on is on, my stat plot is on. And then you can go over to your scatter plot, the one that's flashing, and that one should also be on. And then if you scroll down, you'll see that our X values are under list 1, our Y values are under list 2. The marks that will be on our graphs are a little square. To get out of that screen, just go to second mode, and you're back to your startup screen. Another place that you want to be sure is clear is under Y equals. You want to be sure you don't have any equations there. If you do, you can just hit the clear button and those equations will go away. Okay, that's about it for your tour of your calculator. If you have difficulties, just diagnostic on is one of the main things. Another place that you want to be familiar with is zoom and nine. Uh, to turn it on right now won't help us because we don't have data in our list, but it says zoom stat. The zoom 9 button will set your window so that you can see your graph um, appropriately. Okay, this ends the lesson on just touring your calculator and getting your calculator set. So now you need to go to lesson 4.